Chinese importers are buying more computing chips through Hong Kong in anticipation of U.S. sanctions on the island, which will make the trade much harder. Re-exports of semiconductors through Hong Kong to China jumped 11 percent in the first half of the year, compared to the same period in 2019. Re-exports, which is the export of foreign or imported goods, rose by 21 percent in June alone. The Hong Kong trade represents over 38 percent of China's total chip imports. After Beijing imposed a national security law on Hong Kong, the U.S. government revoked Hong Kong's special trading status, making future computer chip purchases more difficult for Chinese companies like Huawei, Xiaomi, or Lenovo. The Hong Kong Electronics and Technologies Association estimates there are 300 firms that specialize in the trade. It says trading companies in Hong Kong are thinking of setting up new offices in India, Vietnam, and Cambodia to continue selling to Chinese customers, but relocation will be costly. Economists say the new rules could cause a supply blockage for China, resulting in higher transaction costs for the Chinese tech industry. Last week, the U.S. Justice Department made public an indictment of two Chinese nationals accused of spying on the U.S. One of their targets was biotech company Moderna. Moderna is a leading vaccine research developer for the CCP virus. The hackers, which are linked to the Chinese Communist Party, targeted Moderna earlier this year. Moderna is based in Massachusetts. The Trump administration has high hopes that the company can produce a vaccine and is supporting its development with nearly half a billion dollars. Moderna confirmed that they had been in contact with the FBI after the incident. Moderna spokesman said that the company remains highly vigilant to potential cybersecurity threats. They maintain multiple teams to protect valuable information. The FBI and the U.S. Department of Health and Human Services declined to disclose the identities of other U.S. companies also targeted by the Chinese hackers.